All right, everybody. Okay. All right. Wednesdays before bedtime routine. So maybe we're starting this at noon. Maybe we're starting it at five. Doesn't really matter. Whatever works for you with your schedule. Okay. That is the key to the entire fly lady system is making it work for your life. So checking our calendar leads us to do some amazing things that helps us get ready for the morning and takes the stress and attention out of the morning. We will have the kids set up their launch pad if they're doing anything. Have us set up our launch pad because we've checked the calendar so we see what events are going on. All right. And in today's day and age, there are calendars everywhere. There's calendars on the computer. There's calendars on the phone. There's calendars hanging up on the wall. There's calendars on the fridge. There's calendars everywhere. Just got to make sure they're synced. All right. So launch pads are set up. They have pulled up their clothes. We have pulled up our clothes. Because even if tomorrow is a lazy day and you're at home, it doesn't mean you shouldn't look good. I have no sessions on the day when I'm filming this that I'm dressed up. And I'm not going anywhere. I'm not doing anything. But I deserve it. So I'm going to do it. Okay. So now we're going to take a look at our daily goals. We're going to see what three items we want to accomplish tomorrow. And we're going to write those down on your calendar. <laughs> we're going to see what's for dinner tomorrow. Make sure it coordinates with what you got going on. Tomorrow is a little heavier day for me, so I try to either have it be leftovers or something that does not require a lot of effort or something I can throw into the Instapot. Now, you've got your five-minute room rescue and your two-minute hotspot drill in the area that will make the biggest impact on your life for today. Use that timer. It is not a subjective two and five, okay? It is a maximum two and five. I want a chicken. Or five and two. Um, not 20 and 50, okay? All right. So, now we're going to make lunches so that way we don't have to think about them or if we're using leftovers from dinner which we're going to have next then we wait and make lunches after dinner i don't have to worry about that i'm making sandwiches because it's hot and one doesn't want to go and have something hot and i don't blame him so now we're going to shine our sink before we ever leave the kitchen to make it easier to get it done. Because once we go and we sit down, who wants to get back up to the dishes? Not me. I know you're tired by this point. I know you are because I am. And that is why I push through and I do the dishes before I ever leave the kitchen. Ever since I got my kitchen table. Okay. I'm playing more chicken. All right. Kids are getting ready for bed. We're going to get ready for bed because it helps them to get ready for bed when they see us getting ready for bed. And then we're going to pamper ourselves after they go to bed. And we've spent that last three minutes with them. We're going to pamper ourselves. I'm still reading my wonderful book, girls book. And then we're going to go to bed at a decent hour and I will see you for Thursday. Bye. Bye.